Hey guys, the Picky Master here, and welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Clio 4 for your GTA San Andreas on a Mac. Yes, on a Mac. So, here's an application that I actually found from a friend. Um, it's a Clio 4 installer for Mac. So, basically, the first thing we're going to need is the GTA San Andreas game. It doesn't matter what type, as long as you have the game. And then you also need Cleo 4, the Cleo 4 installer that you can download in the description. So, first you open it up. It takes about two tries to open it up because for some reason it crashes on the first try. I don't know. So, see, it opens right there. Oh, it didn't crash on the first try, whatever. So, when it first opens, it'll say, Do you want to install CXEX Jade? Because that's like a needed thing for it. You click yes because obviously you need CXEX Jade or whatever the thing it is that you need to install. So, then it opens up this menu after you've installed it, and you basically uncheck Sammy Builder and uncheck Cleo4.sdk. You just need base Cleo4 files. Then you click Next, and you find your GTA San Andreas folder here. So it's in my GTA Needed folder, GTA San Andreas, Contents, Resources, Trans Gaming, C Drive, Rockstar Games and GTA San Andreas. Clicking next will make it download or install it. I'm not going to click next because I don't want to mess up my my like San Andreas. But once you click next, it'll install it and everything. Then you open up your file and hit find GTA San Andreas. You oh, you click show package contents, contents, resources, trans gaming, C drive. Rockstar Games, GTA San Andreas. Now you have a file called Clio in here. You'll only have um, these, you'll only have the dot, so the ones with dot Clio at the end, those are the ones you'll start off with. The ones that I have are different ones that I downloaded a while back. So, if you want to get a mod, you say download the mod, this is the one I have, spawn sports cars, dot CS. It'll come in a file or whatever. You take the dot CS file and you put it in the Clio folder. Then, if it comes with an FTX or an FXT or whatever file, just put that in Clio text. And then you're good. You've downloaded that mod. I'll give you a demonstration. Okay? Here is my GTA San Andreas. It's pretty awesome. So, here we go. As you can see, I'll have Clio and I'll have mods and stuff like that. So, I'll show you some of the mods um, in a sec. Here we go, GTA San Andreas, whee, da 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 San Andreas, San Andreas, I hope this doesn't like glitch out the recorder, okay, so as you can see, okay, I can't move the mouse, but if you look down the lower right corner, or left corner, you'll see Cleo 4, Vision, whatever, then you click start game, load game, oh crud, what's that noise, ah, my recording, no, this is horrible, oh my goodness, okay, that's better, turned off. Now, so here's my game, and I'll show you the mod that I installed. Spawn sports. You can spawn your sports cars by name. So here we go. Um, here, I'll give you a demonstration of some of the mods I have. Save anywhere. You click these two keys, and it spawns, and you can save anywhere. And then you can spawn sports cars by name. Watch. I just type bullet. It takes like, sometimes. Okay, that didn't work. B u l l e t. Oh, come on. There we go. Cheat activated. Spawn the car. So that's pretty awesome. And you can spawn other cars. I just don't know the names of all of them. And then, uh, save anywhere, etc. You can do this. Change your skin. Like, you can make yourself... You can spawn a pedestrian, like... Or you can change yourself into one. And it's pretty awesome. So, um... That's... I just closed my game. So that's, uh, basically it. So see you guys! Um, and I guess you'll be having a good day, so...